A family reeling from a painful loss of a mother and child are seeking answers as to what caused a car crash on Kauai. And today we learn the delivery truck did everything he could to avoid the vehicle coming straight at him. Four people were killed when a Nissan Cube crossed the center line and crashed into an oncoming delivery truck on Kauai last week. The driver of the truck was not seriously hurt. Kauai police are asking witnesses to step forward to help them figure out what caused the crash. Bridget Namada follows up. Bridget? Yeah, Joe, Chelsea Lynn Pereira's brother tells me the family is trying to stay positive, but the sudden, shocking loss of his sister and two-year-old nephew hurts. Keikoa Kamat describes the moment he learned his sister Chelsea and two-year-old nephew Kavai Nakoa were involved in a car crash. It was heartbreaking. Um, it felt like somebody stole a piece of my, my heart away from me. It's something I wish nobody has to go through. We're taking it one day at a time. But we're just going back on their memories that we have. Like I said, the videos of my nephew and stuff. Chelsea and Kavai were flown to Queens Medical Center on Oahu in critical condition and later died. Chelsea leaves behind three other children under the age of seven. Kamat tells me their family is picking up the pieces, but a big question remains. We just want to know what really happened. Kauai police say the driver of the Nissan Cube veered into the opposite lane on Kohio Highway and Kealia. The driver collided with a Paradise Beverages delivery truck. Photos of the scene taken by Kauai Police Department show the aftermath of the crash. The president of Paradise Beverages tells me the driver suffered minor injuries, but it affected him in another way. The driver knew some of the passengers in the Nissan Cube. He was one of the first um, uh, at, at the car to get to the car and see what you know what, what help they could render, uh, and and it was uh, uh, you know a tragic uh, sight for him. I, I'll tell you, our driver uh, did everything he could to avoid uh, you know the oncoming car. In fact, he, he was concerned that he ran out of, of space on the right edge um, you know, without uh, endangering himself by going through the guardrail and, and, and over, uh, uh, over the cliff. So, uh, you know, he felt bad about that. I called Kauai's police chief, Daryl Perry. He tells me the investigation into the crash is ongoing. The department will examine all of the cell phones in the car to see if distracted driving is a factor. They're also waiting on toxicology reports. Perry does not think speed was a factor in the crash. Bridget Namata, KHON2 News.